And I know you said she's your type, and with them being twins, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I don't think I'm into people, you know, where their name starts with A. Um, I love all your attributes, but just where my type. Hold on, what you say? Still popping your balloon. I do see like a brother and like a homeboy. I'm gonna be honest. And the type okay. of person I am, I have big mama energy, and I'm big a mama. big dominant. And yeah, thinking like if you were like in my bed or something, and I turned the fan on, like you would fly across my room because you like really skinny. But I like. You. Wow, son! Turn it up! Mm. Turn it up! Turn it up! Turn it up! Welcome back, Dukes. And do you guess it's your man Eddie Ed? You watch Eddie Ed TV back with another video, baby. Listen, we have a video from uh, I forgot her name. Let me look up her name real quick. Arletta Mooley. She does the she she does pop the balloon or find love videos. She was the I guess the originator originator of it, and we have a video of one that she posted about like ten days ago. This might come out probably 20 days from from now but anyway we have a video from her i'm ready to see what this is i've been watching this with the wife it's funny um they they do have some some very interesting people that come on here and say you say some funny stuff but without further ado let's hop straight into the video enough talking it's eddie at tv pow hello welcome in i'll have you hold that what's your name all right my name is uh ma wooten why do you gotta pop it when he say his name? Dang, dog. I moved it. Why? Come on, son. Why they do? Look at all them wearing heels. Everybody's feet is like this. Everybody's feet is like this. Hold on. Everybody's feet is is is. is everybody's toes is pointed to the ground. Everybody's feet is like that, dog. Everybody. Everybody's taller. So off the rip, if the guy is shorter than them, than them in heels, they're cutting them off. I don't. They're. They're, yeah, they're gonna cut them off. I promise you. It's Yoruba. Okay, and how old are you? I'm 27 years old. Are they scared of African guys? Uh, hey, all right. Oh, okay. and I also go by Moses. Got it. Okay. It was given to me by a prophet seven days after my birth. Oh, okay. Yeah. So in this situation, do you prefer us to call you Moses? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and Moses, what do you do? I am Moses, an dog. Space engineer. And <laughs> yeah, Moses. I'm also COO and co-founder of my own fitness tech startup that I'm building uh, cool. called Fit KO. Okay. Yeah. Uh, now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Well, I like to you know, hit the gym, you know, lift some weights. Hey, uh, I also, I'm also learning boxing, you okay. know, to help with my startup. And like biking, like video essays. I'm kind of nerdy like that, <laughs> where I like video essays about psychology, philosophy, stuff like that. Got and it. then after I'm done with all my responsibilities, you know, game for a little bit. Okay. You know, board games with some friends, family. Oh, nice. Yeah. And now what are some things you look for in a woman? I really enjoy kindness. You know, someone I can feel comfortable around. You know, someone who doesn't take themselves too seriously, doesn't take life too seriously. And, you know, we can build together and be, you know, have passion. Okay. You know, passion about our our hobbies, uh, our nah, hey. careers. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Now the way you said passion, ain't no passion about hobbies and stuff. You want passion with action. You want that bedroom passion, son. No, no, hey, hey, don't lie. And just be happy, passionate people together. Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Deal breakers. Yeah. Uh, I guess I'd have to say kids, but not like a direct deal breaker. I'd prefer not. Okay. Only because I didn't really grow up. <laughs> I really grow up with like you know little cousins, little sisters, little, you know. So I feel like I'm not, you know, built for that. <laughs> but I'm not. It's not. I'm not completely against it. Okay. So you're. You don't want kids at all, or? Oh, I do just, want you, kids. Okay. Yeah. You just don't want to date someone with kids. Yeah. Well, that's not a preference for right now. I see a little in, in my future okay. because right now I see myself. I'm like building my castle, you mm. know, mm -hmm. before I bring, you know, my princess in, you know. Okay. All right, so we did get um, a few pop balloons. Let's yeah. go on over to those ladies, see why they ended up popping, uh -huh. okay? Let's start right on over here with your name and age. Hi, my name is Jasmine, I'm 24. And Jasmine, what do you do? I'm a cosmetologist and I do fitness on the side. Okay. Oh, cool. And uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? Well, I um, 
I just waited a little bit just because I like to hear people out, yeah. you know. Um, but I do have two kids. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Obviously, you know, you said the kids. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not a deal breaker per se, but, you know. Got it. But she's someone that's your type? I'd say she's my type. She's very pretty, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. She's got a nice smile. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's go on to our next lady over here. Your name and age? Uh, my name is Alexis. I'm 24. And Alexis, what do you do? I work for the state Are of Arizona. twins? Very cool. So, obviously, I don't know if you noticed. We do got twins here. Oh, they are twins. You notice that? I was about to say, I'm like, hold on. She looked like her, but she look. Oh, she's wearing the heels. She's wearing the heels. Okay. I was about to, like, yeah, they look alike. I'm like, dang, hold on. That's her sister? I know it's now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Okay. I'm a little, a little slow sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> and Alexis, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, just not physically attracted. Look, you're very handsome, but... Don't worry, I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll hold on to that compliment for at least 10 years. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I know you said she's your type, and with them being twins, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I don't think I'm into people, you know, with their name starts with A. You know, okay. I'm, I'm completely joking. No, I'm just saying. <laughs> 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 That's a good joke. Thank you. Let's go on to our next lady over here. Hey, my guy jo throwing a little, you know, a couple jokes at him. Like, hey, he... He feeling kind of good. Alaya, and I'm 25. Alaya, what do you do? I'm a cake decorator. Oh. Oh. And uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? It's just the overall aesthetic. I just don't feel like it matched my vibe. Yeah. Come so on, son. Hold, hold on. Hold on. I'm, oh, I'm lactose intolerant, so. Oh, oh, he about to throw another joke in like there. It matched but, my vibe. But, but, okay, okay. Now, now with the dressing thing, okay, it's like, yeah, first presentation, first impression, it, it's going to matter. But, dang, man, like, yeah. Ah, I mean, you know, but we ain't going no first date yet. Second, like we, you don't know the wardrobe like that. But it's understandable, first impression. So I guess. Uh, so that's just it. Oh, Other I'm all, I'm lactose intolerant, so we couldn't get along. <laughs> that's fine as well. Is <laughs> 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 Aliyah? I mean, I'm saying that right. Is she someone that you? <laughs> I like bright colors, you know, it really like pops. Mm -hmm. So I'd say so. Okay, uh -huh. thank you. <laughs> thank you. Hey, hey, hey he was nice with it. Your name and age. He was I'm nice Asia, with I'm it. I'm 25. And Asia, what do you do? No, doing? no, no, hold on. That's hilarious. He said, I, I like bright colors. That had nothing to do with her in particular. But hey, he let it down easy, I guess. You know what I mean? I do modeling, content creation, and, and I work with the black owned brands. Ooh. Yeah. Why well, she had to put a black owned and, brand uh, in there? Why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I love all your attributes, but just weren't my type. Hold on, what you say? I'm popping your balloon. Um, I love all your attributes, but just weren't my type. Yeah, fair, fair. Yeah. Okay. What she makes them not really your that. type? Um, I would say the aesthetic. Okay. Yeah. She just used what, the last person, man. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's just not for me. I like the aesthetic. See? I like the shirt. You know, I like see? And then you're gonna say you like the shirt, you like the pants. Like, what are you talking about then? Huh? What the heck, man? I don't understand what she's trying to say. She liked the shirt, she just don't like him. Just be honest, bro. Stop trying to stop doing this, man. We from New York. I like how you put it all together, but I don't I don't think it's for me. Mm. Yeah, so something. <laughs> so I can't about. put my finger on oh. it. See? See? Flat shoes. That might be it. See? Uh, okay. See, yeah. he gave her uh, high heels. Next Please. Time. Yeah, I'll <laughs> enjoy that. <laughs> so what's what, did you, what would you say is your aesthetic? Because you've got that twice now. That they don't, I don't know. I'm kind it. of a door. Okay. But like an endearing door, you mm. know. Okay. You know? <laughs> you know, I can talk your head off about like some random topic, you know. Got it. You know, it I love I love women who are yappers. So <laughs> that's like that's my, my thing. Okay. Uh, that's got, and it's got funny. Uh-huh. Mm. I don't know. Models, they, you know, they, they got a lot of business prospects. They got to be flying in and out mm. places. I, I like someone who's a little closer. Okay. So I, I did fly here, so I get it. <laughs> right, thank you. <laughs> get her, get her out of here. <laughs> Your why why is she pop? We're going to find out. My name is Princess. I'm 23. And Princess, what do you do? Um, customer service and real estate. Mm -hmm. And why did you end up popping your balloon? Initially, it was the outfit that threw me off, okay. um, but I do have a daughter, so. 
Got it. Okay. And now, is uh, Princess someone that's your type? I do like tattoos. You know, <laughs> I like art of any kind. I appreciate um, it. Honestly, I don't really have like a type type. Okay. And I had to get to know someone to really be close to them. That that's sense. why I like yappers. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's go over wow, here. Wow, this guy's hilarious. I'm Alex. I'm 25. And Alex, what do you She's do? She's 25. I'm a data analyst. Oh. Ed, Hold on. I'm 25. And Alex, what do you do? I'm a data analyst. Oh. And uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? Too much going on. Um, Dang. Look at the size of the. Listen, okay, for ladies. I'm just look. This is this is a this those lashes are some of the biggest I've seen. You know what I mean? So I had to make a comment. Those lashes are large, man. That's those are fly swatters right there. Like no flies are getting into her eyes. All she gotta do is blink and they fly bro. Why the eyelashes? Too much going too much going on, bro. <clears throat> too much going on. I got a lot of brothers that will agree with me. Maybe not this lifetime. Maybe the next lifetime, next lifetime. when we're like butterflies and squirrels. You know, like if we got like got reincarnated. But this lifetime, Dang, it's not you, in God's plan. You yeah, know? You, you kept your balloon the longest. I thought. Yeah, I was trying to find a, some trying razzle to like, dazzle you're about trying to see you, the next but lifetime. it wasn't razzling or dazzling for no, me. razzling so. and dazzling. But you're very sweet, though. I'm Somebody will, will love you for who you are. But yeah. Why she got to go there, bro? You know? I, I love me, but <laughs> it's okay good. if you don't love me. Somebody will, uh, just, just not me. Eventually. But, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know, she's someone that's your type. Uh, <laughs> next question. <laughs> wait, wait. Uh, next question. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Next question. Oh, yo, this guy. This I like this guy. This guy said next Question, bro, the eyelashes, bro. What are you doing with that on? And the makeup, she probably has too much makeup. She probably has, the eyelashes are going crazy. You know what I mean? That's what, as far as I'm going to go. Like, a lot of guys don't like all that. We don't like the clown action. The clown action? Come on, baby. Come on. <laughs> okay. Thank you. That's what she get. That's what she get. And her toes, look, look, I'm... I'm just pointing it out. Her toes are spilling out of her shoes. Whatever that means, that's what it means. Hi, I'm Taylor, and I'm 22. Taylor, what do you do? I'm a lash artist, so I do that full time. <laughs> and uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, it's the outfit. <laughs> I'm just not feeling it. Okay. And I don't know, the aesthetic, too. Mm. This not my type. <laughs> Wait, isn't like aesthetic and like like the outfit the... Like the same thing? I mean, like the whole video gaming and like. Oh, look at that last. Dang, I should yeah. have not Well, that. I mean, you said like. <laughs> After I'm done with my responsibilities. Yeah. You know, as a co founder. I'm just, mm, not feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, like, I think it's just physically like attraction. Like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I can't change that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you said next question on that last one. Is she your type? Uh, <laughs> I don't think it. Anything in particular, I, I prefer kindness. I guess kindness is my oh, type. Okay. Sorry. Uh, but. <laughs> Just being honest, I mean. <laughs> All right, cool, thank you. Let's go on to our last lady here. Your name and age? Paris, I'm 28. And Paris, what do you do? I do property management, model, content creation, yeah. stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. Busy, yep. <laughs> yeah. Now, uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I do see you like a brother and oh. like a homeboy. I'm gonna be honest. And the type okay. of person I am, I have big mama energy and I'm big a mama. big dominant. And yeah. Yeah. Let's see. I, I wish I understood what that meant. So. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, it's like I'm a person that like power mm -hmm. and I carry along like alpha men energy. Mm -hmm. I'm an alpha female that's also in tune uh, with my, my divine yes. feminine and masculine energy. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm somehow more confused, but I, I, I like I, I, I like I, I like know. long ex explanations. You know, I like I like things that are, that are in depth, even if I have no idea what she's saying. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I wish. I just okay. said. Okay. <laughs> And now, is she someone that she, she's your type? If you saw her out, would you approach her? Uh, I don't know. I, I guess the dominant aura would just keep me away. I'd be like, oh, oh God. I, I, I get a little scared, you know? Okay. 
but <laughs> all right cool <laughs> thank you all right let's head on back this way so hey, this that guy is all of the balloons popped unfortunately this guy is but silly we do thank you for coming on let's go ahead and give it up for him ladies well, have fun <laughs> nice meeting y'all thank you right. <laughs> single guy hello welcome in what's your name Oh, so look, she changed her shoes. I noticed she had on the, her feet was the, the, the girl in the brown or black. Yeah. The brown right here. She switched her shoes. She wore the heels at first, but I guess her feet was, was choking. Cause I can see it, like it was spilling out. Honestly, it was spilling out. <clears throat> and so she switched her shoes on us. There she go. That make more sense. Like they should all wear flats, bro. All of them should, should like be being flats. That's just me, so that I can't use that dumb excuse. Oh, I'm telling you in the hills, so I can't. Uh. So my name is Jairus Williams. Jairus? Jairus Williams. Okay, and how old are you? I'm 26. 26, and what do you do? Oh, wow, he seemed so like... So I'm a Marine vet, and I'm a Christian recording artist. I sing. Okay, so thank you for your service. Oh, thank you. <laughs> well, what are some things you like to do for fun? Uh, I love the water. I'm a water baby, so... Okay. Uh, you know, I was, um, I'm the only home birth out of uh, all eight children, wow. so... Um, I love the water because I was born in the water, so okay. I'm a little fishy, you know. <laughs> I'm a little swimmer, you know what I mean? Okay. So. And uh, what are some things you look she for? She popped them on a fishy. Um, she got to be God fearing for sure, um, and she got to be kind. Mm -hmm. She got to be gentle. She got to be loving, and uh, she also got to support her man okay. in everything that he do, just like I'm gonna support you in everything that you do. Got it. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Um, somebody who's not willing um, to listen, willing to learn. Um, willing to grow in their relationship with God. I understand that some people may not know who God is or never have an experience with God. But if you're willing, like God expects us to be, I can rock with that. That's a good point. <clears throat> That's a good point. Working with somebody that uh, is able, is willing to listen, willing to uh, learn. Those are good qualities because, <clears throat> you know, as, the, as definitely adults, young adults, whatever, you know, you get a lot of people that's headstrong, that don't want to listen, that don't want to, uh, you know, give you a chance you know to explain yourself x y and z so those qualities are good qualities i think to have in a person it doesn't even matter what if you're dating or not just like a person that would just listen and, and that would <clears throat> you know hear you out and also willing to learn something new you know and not always be embarrassed about stuff that they don't know and and, and just willing to be open to 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 learn new things you know what i mean and so <clears throat> those are some good qualities i would say okay all right, mm -hmm. so we, we did get a, a pop balloon. That's all right. Let's head on over there and see why she ended up popping. Hello, if we could start off with your name and age. Why the twins? Jasmine. Why the twins got to do it? Okay. And Jasmine, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I think you're very handsome. Sure. You know, but it's just not really my my type. But you're very handsome. Okay. And I love the words you spoke. So yeah. Okay. Okay. And so, what makes him not really your type? Um, I. Well, I think he's really handsome. I just think that, you Thank know. You. Yeah, of course. Um, and he spoke beautiful words, and I love that, you know. But it's just not really my um, thing. I think maybe the girl. Maybe that. Oh, I'm from Texas, so that's, what, that's how we get down. So. Oh, I, it's nice, though. <laughs> oh, I appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> and now, is she someone that's your type? Um, she's very beautiful. Um, I don't really do a whole lot of approaching. Okay. So, um not that I'm against it or anything like that, but she's definitely so, like, very, very beautiful. So, okay. absolutely. All right, cool. Thank you. Let's go to our next lady. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon? Um, my name is Alexis. I'm 24. Hello. And um, I popped my balloon because, like my sister said, <laughs> you're very handsome. You're, you know, very well put together. Thank you for your service, by the way. Well, thank you. I appreciate you. Uh -huh. um, it's just not... Like you're not. Hey, hold on. Hey, why you popping? Why everybody popping, man? Chill. Like, they, come on. Give the Texas brother. Come on, man. Bad looking. I'm just not like attractive. Okay, that's fine. I actually like the girls here, brother. Oh, I appreciate it. <laughs> that's okay. All right. So I know you said you don't do a lot of approaching, mm -hmm. and they are sisters. So you said you. Like oh, yeah, God. we definitely don't do that. I'm a man of God, so. Yeah. Oh, no, no, I didn't say you approach them both. Oh. I meant say, like, they're twins. Oh, okay. <laughs> he, he thought he was talking about get both of them. He said, we definitely don't do that. I'm a man of God. Hey, he keeping it real. You know, he keeping it real. He, he, he ain't doing doubles. He's doing only singles. So, 
I appreciate him making that clear in case anything might have been put in there. But anyway, <clears throat> but that's hilarious. Hey, okay, awesome. Okay. <laughs> so I know you said she was, you know, she was ready for all that Absolutely. stuff. So is she someone that you type as well? Uh, yes. Okay. Just wasn't approach. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go to our next lady here. Your name and age? Alaya, and I'm 25. Right, and Hello. Alaya, why'd you end up you don't look 25. Your it's the water thing. I have a fear of the water. I can't swim to save my life, so that wouldn't be a you good could learn. I can't swim either, so. You, you want to? <laughs> <laughs> I'm being honest. But you love the water? How I got a life jacket. Okay. I'll stay with him. So I got one for you, too. Uh, I mean, well, I had one for you. So. <laughs> okay. It was prepared. That. You prepared. Mm. Yeah, but it was the water thing. It was, I thought that was, like, a big thing for you. It was, like, in your lifestyle, and I didn't want to be, you know, intruding on that. So oh, I appreciate that. that. Mm -hmm. It's cool. Okay. I mean, she don't look 25. Swim. He got a life jacket for you. I don't know, but it seemed like he want to do a lot of water activities, and I, you know, <laughs> I don't think I can do it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So is she someone that's your type? Um, yes, yeah, she's very beautiful. Mm -hmm. I still wouldn't approach. Okay. I'm very particular. Okay. Thank you. Let's go over okay, here. Okay, so so his tactic of letting him down <clears throat> is pretty cool. Like he's like, "Hey, it's pretty, but I wouldn't approach." So I know what he's saying, but it, he's letting him down real nicely. I like that. Your name and age? I'm Asia. I'm 25. How you doing, bro? You don't look well. Okay, I'm not. She don't look 25. And Asia, why'd you end up popping your balloon? Um, no particular reason. It's mm. just you look um, 35 at least, bro. But like, so does not the really other my one. Type. Okay. I love that what you were saying about the Lord, though, for sure. For I'm sure. With that. Okay. Yeah. What kind of makes him not really your type? A little taller. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah. We hear that sometimes. Exactly. You know, we can't change our height, so yeah. it's all good. Okay. You know. And how tall are you? Uh, I'm 5'10". That's mm. not bad. It's not bad. Okay. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. Yeah, man. <laughs> it's and, all right. <laughs> and now she's someone that's your type? Um, she's very attractive. Uh, still would not approach because I'm very particular. I know what I'm looking for. All right. All right. Thank yep. you. Yep. So there we go, man. Over here. Your name and age? <clears throat> princess. I'm 23. Okay. And princess. Hello. Definitely princess, don't look 23, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, I would say at look first older. it was the whole cowboy thing, but I was like, you know, that's not. But then the more I thought about it, I'm more so spiritual. I've been trying to figure out how I feel about religion. You know, mm. I grew up Christian and into oh, that, but I've been man. figuring out myself. So I feel like, you know, I feel like you probably want someone who's already finding their self with God type type deal. Uh, not necessarily. Um, so I'm a Christian recording artist. I'm a Christian man. Um, but my, my debut album is called Coming Into Faith. So it's telling my testimony. Mm -hmm. I was still in the clubs. I was still drinking, smoking, partying. Um, I faced death and stuff like that multiple times. So um, I don't, you know, judge people where they are. You know, uh, we can grow together if that was going to be a thing. You know what I mean? Um, I just wanted somebody who was willing, you know? Yeah, you don't have that. to be, like, on this high level, like, right. super, like, pastor and this and that. Like, no, mm -hmm. absolutely not. Okay, I feel that. Mm -hmm. right, thank you. It's going over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hi, I'm Alex. I'm 25. Hello. Well, nice to meet you. Nice to meet um, you, too. You're really cute. I'm just not a fan of piercings. Oh, that's okay. That's it. I mean, yeah, just piercings. Oh, okay. I respect that. Okay. And now she's someone that's your type? Uh, she's very attractive. Um, I know I'm saying a lot of the same things, but uh, at the end of the day, I just still wouldn't approach. Um, not anything against you or anything. I, like I said, I know what I'm looking for, so. Respect. Mm -hmm. But you are very beautiful. I want to let you know that. Thank you. For sure. All right, let's go over here. Your name and age? Hi, I'm Taylor. I'm 22. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Um, the reason I just feel like more like close friends, you know, you're attractive. I like, I like it all, but for sure. Yeah. I'm just getting like, we can have like a real good bond. Yeah. <laughs> Feeling the same vibes. Oh, I appreciate the friend. Um, how she said we can be close friends and things like that, but, um, I'm not looking for friends right now. Um, uh, I'm looking for love, you know, somebody to marry and cherish. Um, and have kids with and stuff like that, so. Understandable. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go on over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. So, my name is Paris. I'm 28. Hello. Hey, if she say that alpha female crap again, I'm, I'm, I'm ending it here, man. <clears throat> I promise you. <clears throat>
if she's well, actually, we we, we gonna hear her out. You know what I mean? If she even say that, but after that, I'm I'm done. We gotta cut her out the list, man. Come on. Hi. So I popped my balloon because um, <laughs> I'm an ominous, and I don't want it to get to a point where it's just like it becomes forceful in the situation. Like everything you list is cool. Like I'm like a person <gasps> that um, I'm supportive of everything and everybody, and whatever their journeys are, it's just that it's gonna always be an issue. Like in the future like hold on i gotta look up what ominous is because ominous hold on we gotta look that up man we gotta go back to what she said i tried to find that ominous word i don't know what i don't know hold on we gotta go back like i'm like a person that i just want a situation like everything you live get to a point um, <laughs> I'm an ominous and I don't want it to get to a point where it's just like ominous. Listen, I have never heard that word before. Somebody that knows that word, drop it in the doggone uh, comments for me. Let me know what that means, because I don't know what that means. Help me out. It becomes forceful in the situation. Like everything you list is cool. Like I'm like a person that um, I'm supportive of everything and everybody and whatever their journeys are. It's just that it's going to always be an issue like in the future like when are you going to you know come back and i kind of graduated from religion so graduated yeah. okay but uh, you is handsome as fuck though i ain't gonna lie okay that's i appreciate it. you <laughs> and you're very beautiful uh, i just wanted to say um you know from the bottom of my heart um god has saved me from a lot of things like i said i faced death uh, a lot of times and um He's the only one that brought me through. So I can sing, I have a gift to sing, and I'm very good at it. And so I gave it to the Lord, and he gave it back to me. And he said, go reach my people. I'm gonna give you the message to convey. Now go convey. And I'm gonna be an, I'm gonna be an obedient child, and I'm gonna do just that. Um, so nothing or no one can detour me from that, but I do appreciate your honesty and being upfront with me. Absolutely, but um, that's just my calling, and I don't force that on anybody. Understood. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's head back this way. Okay, so that is all the balloons popped, but we do thank you very much for coming on. Let's thank go ahead you. and give it up for them, ladies. Thank y'all, ladies. Thank you. Uh, he undid it well. <clears throat> we got our next single guy. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? So my name's Ron. Ron, okay, and Ron, how old are you? I'm 26. 26, and what do you do? So I'm in the military, and I own my own business. Okay, thank you for your service. Thank you, thank you, thank <laughs> and, you. And uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I like to play basketball. Uh, I'm getting into photography, and um, pretty much just hang out with my friends, you know. That's pretty much it. Okay. <laughs> and hey, she get on my nerves, man. That girl get on my nerves, son. Bro, why she popping everybody off of the, like, what is she, I want to know what the dude she looks like or, or she likes looks like. That's what I want to know. What in the world do you like? And what be throwing her off? Like, I don't know. Let's go. There's some things you look for in a woman. Um, you just pretty much just have to want to be led by a man, you know, um, pretty ambitious mm -hmm. and it's pretty much it, you know? Okay. All right, what are some deal breakers? Um, if you do have children, you know, I want to start a family. Hold on. Wait, and, and look, I am observant to certain things, but look, the girl that changed her her heels to flats changed the other flats to something other than what she wore before. Let's see. What? It just she got on. The girl in the brown, I'm talking about the brown dress, the big, with, with the big eyelashes. Look at her feet. Now she got on some different shoes. Now she got on something more comfortable. So she had feet problems, y'all. I, I don't know why I noticed that, but I, I mean, those are pretty, like, different. You know what I'm saying? So I guess they are noticeable. But anyway, let's <laughs> let's move forward, man. Okay. All right, what are some deal breakers? Um, if you do have children, you know, I want to start a family of my own. And then um, pretty much I just got to be able to show, like, my mother, like your Instagram and stuff, you know, can't be doing too much and you laughing and stuff. Okay. <laughs> you know, she got to approve pretty all much. Right, all right, all right. Approve on the Instagram. You have to, have okay, to. Okay, yeah. all right. So we did get a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over there, see okay, what's okay. going on. All right, let's start with your name and age. 
Hi, my name is Jasmine. I'm 24. And why did you end up popping? Hey, hold on. If her twin end up popping after her sister start talking like she did some of the others, bro. Your balloon. Um, I think he's really handsome. It's just I'm big on energy, and I just wasn't getting it. Okay. Yeah. Like you mean like you want high energy or just like a you know okay. energy? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> now, Sexual. That's your type. Yeah, I would definitely approach her outside of here. You know, she's beautiful. Thank Can't you. Can't complain. No. And then we did get one down there. Oh, we got two down here. Okay. Let's start right here with your name and age. I'm Princess. I'm her sister looking at her like I'm Princess. Why are you end up popping pop? your balloon? I have a child. She's five. Mm -hmm. Okay. So children are a deal breaker for you. It is. Is she someone that is your type though? Um, yeah, I would say. Appreciate yeah. it. You yeah. look good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I like the lashes. I respect it. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> and then we got nah. one more down here. You don't like them lashes though. Okay, we can you have You don't like those. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a goofball. But I'm Paris. I'm 28. Okay. And Paris, why did you end up popping your balloon? So, like I said, you are handsome. However, I do model and content creation. Not what you think. No, not like that. But you said your mom is going to look. Not saying I got bad pictures, but I got a lot of creative pictures with different outfits and stuff. And I don't know where, And she don't understand, like, creative, artsy things. Then she mm -hmm. won't understand where I'm going with it. I'm going to be honest. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now, has your mom told you no before off of a girl's Instagram? Yeah, she has. Oh. <laughs> You know, she's Puerto Rican. She don't, she don't really play with that. Oh, yeah. So. Okay. <laughs> and now is a Paris someone that you type? Um, n no. <laughs> hey. Not. Uh, just the physical attraction wasn't there. You know. Thank you, Thank son. You. <laughs> Thank All you, right, baby. Let's head on back. So we do still have five balloons Gosh. left unpopped. There we I'm go. I'm gonna have you ask these ladies a question, help you narrow it down, see who's more of your match. Okay. Tell us straight so, up. Um, it's kind of like a three-part question. So like, when was your last relationship? How did it end, and um, how long ago was it? Okay, let's start right that here was the with same. your name no, he and age and the answer to his questions. Um, my name is Alexis. I'm 24. Um, my last relationship was about two years ago. It ended because we just went like the compatibility just started, you know, separating. Okay. And uh. we were together for four years. Okay. Let's go to our next lady. Name and age and the answer to his question. Aliyah and I'm 25 and my last relationship was the end of 2022 and we broke it off because of trust issues we had a lot of miscommunication we couldn't get on the same page so we just had to break things off and we were together for two years when you say we it was like you and him or as in trust issues no it was him okay yeah okay Good. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. I'm good. <laughs> Your name and age and the answer to his question. I'm Asia. I'm 25. Um, my last relationship was about like two years ago. Lasted for three years, and it ended because it was just extremely toxic. Yeah, it was terrible. Probably pretty much the same thing. Was I like don't know if it's me, but the the girl that's just talking, she just looked like she'll stab you. That's just what I'm getting, man. She looked like she'll take it to the violence. Chest knife in the chest, gun pointed at your head, following you to the store. She just seemed a little wild to me. Am I going crazy? Let me know in the comments, man. I'm just, I'm just saying what's on my mind. Like toxic. Was both I toxic? Ways, both ways. I mean. Well, I did have a hand to play, but not initially. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you look like you ain't believing it. What's going yeah, on? Yeah, I'm not believing that. She said she had a hand to play with it. I mean, yeah. I don't. Nah, bro. That sounds like some um. So uh, uh, what's that Tyler Perry movie with Tupar, uh, uh, Taraji P. Henson? Um, shoot. Acrimony? She got some acrimony action going on over there, man. Like, when she, like yeah, she got some acrimony action. The nails look like she, she'll scratch your eyeball out. She just seemed very like, she, she, to me, I think she got the mouth on her. You know, like the yappity yap. She'll, she'll definitely get you. Right here, she'll be, she'll get you right here. So, so probably that was her hand to play, and the guy probably got tired of it, and then she started getting. But I don't know, but I could just imagine with her, it's gonna be a tough time. I could be totally wrong. Okay, I'm just going off based on what I am sensing. I'm 26 now. I'm not that I don't really have time for that. It's like yeah, no, I don't do the toxic toxicity stuff. for That's me now. It's kind of like done. That's why it's done. I respect it. You know, yeah. I went your separate ways, but yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. 
Let's go on over here. Ooh. We'll be back. <laughs> your name and age and the answer. Ooh. You know, I went your separate ways, but yeah. city for That's me now is kind of like done. A, That's why it's done. I respect it. You know, yeah. I went your separate ways, but yeah. Yeah. Let's go on over here. Ooh. <laughs> we'll be back. <laughs> your name and age and the answer to this question. Hi, I'm Alex. I'm 25. So my last relationship was 2022. We were together like five months, not long, but um, he had like issues, like he was a liar, nothing he said added up. <laughs> he get mad a lot, like tantrums and stuff, and I didn't want to deal with that. Okay, thank you. Over here, your name and age and the answer to this question. Hi, I'm Taylor, I'm 22. Um, it just marked two years that I've been single. <laughs> We were together for two years, and I ended it because I just didn't feel like I was growing with him. It was just stuck. Mm -hmm. So I just, yeah, just couldn't do it. Mm -hmm. uh, I guess I would ask you another question is like, did you do anything to try to like I mean, I was, motivate or anything? Yeah, I was there. Um, I was very motivating him, but he just, priorities, they weren't together, so. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. So our lady back here did end up popping. What's going on? Oh, I just popped because I felt like he was gonna pop my balloon or something. Oh. You know, because I said uh, the toxic stuff. <laughs> yeah. Were you about to pop hers yeah, off with that? Yeah, okay. I was. Yeah. Okay. You <laughs> yeah. So she felt it coming. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Appreciate. Sure I respect that. I respect it though. Let's head on back, let's head on back. So let's go ahead and ask these, mm, actually she popped, but I'm gonna have you pop one of these ladies' balloons just based off of what you've heard so far. So let me hand you a pick. There you go. Is it based off what I heard? Yeah, what you've heard, what you see, whatever it may be, go ahead and pop one of the remaining balloons. Right. Okay, why did we end up popping hers? Um, I just don't think the physical attraction was there. You know, I mean, there we go. It, you know. There we go. So, um, <clears throat> why did you have your balloon unpopped for him? Hey, I'm liking this guy, bro, because he's just keeping it straight. The physical attraction, bow. That's it. Don't be hitting me with the nice dress and yeah. Just keep it straightforward. We don't need all the fluff. Let's keep it tough. You know what I mean? Well, I thought he was cute, but then I had like some concerns. I don't even want me to say it or not. Say it. Okay, so. I'm not trying to be funny. So I was. She hurt, baby. She, she hurt. hurt. He he popped up a little based on physical attractions. Now she said, "Oh, I did have some concerns." Now she's about to try to get him. She gonna try to get him, man. Watch this. Let's see. I don't know. It's like thinking like if you were like in my bed or something, and I turned the fan on, like you would fly across my room because you're like really skinny. But I like. Wow, son. What? She, bro, are you serious? She put really skinny? Why is she lying? Bro, she lying, bro. Bro, come on, bro. She is lying. Is, is she serious? I, I Fly across the room when you turn on the fan is ridiculous. What is she talking, bro? She obviously is hurt, bro. Wow. I gotta take a sip of. I can't believe she said that, bro. Really skinny. And then I was also thinking, like, if I was in the bed with you and I'd lay my head on your chest, it would feel like I'm laying on a pile of dishes or something. So I didn't wanna, you know. Yeah. But you're cute, though, so. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. I'm 205 pounds, by the way. Oh, um, oh okay. That, that's just funny. So, I mean, <laughs> yeah, he's 205 pounds. What are you talking about? She is hurt, baby. Bro, that's clear hurt. She just wanted to insult him because he don't physically like her. That's it. Why she had no, she didn't say, she was just trying to get hers off. She was furious, baby. Listen, he kept it honest. And now she getting disrespectful. Talking about turn on a fan, you're gonna fly across the room, put my head on your chest, you're gonna, it's gonna feel like a pile of dishes. I know. You feel how you feel, it is what it is. There's no offense. I mean, no, I like skinny guys, you know, but. No, I appreciate you being honest. I was just you know? looking out for you, looking out for me, but <laughs> yeah. That's all.
right, thank you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> go ahead and ask these remaining ladies a question. <laughs> um, <laughs> any of y'all always in the club? Friday, Saturday, Sunday. <laughs> Like, pretty much popping out <laughs> all the time. Okay, that's your question? Pretty much. Hey, 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 listen. The question, the 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 thing that the girl said, he was like, bro, she is just, she is so annoying, bro. Well, hold on, hold on. Let's go back to how, how he was asking this. Because he's, he's, he's tired at this point. He's like, bro, like, this girl just threw me off. Let's hear it one more time. He had me laughing. Any of y'all always in the club? <laughs> Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Like, pretty much popping out all the time. Okay, that's your question? Pretty much. Okay. You always outside. <laughs> um, no, I feel like I did that when I was, you know, 21, 22. So, I got that out the way, I feel like. Okay. He wants to know if you're always outside. Definitely not. I am a homebody for sure. Okay. <laughs> All right. Then we got one more down here. All right. Are we outside? Um. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wait. Okay. When I was twenty, <laughs> when I turned twenty-one, like I was outside the whole year. I waited till I was like twenty-one to get in the club, so I never like snuck in the club or nothing. But like now, I'm just. I've honestly been taking life more seriously, so. I mean, like, I'm single still, so if someone asks me to, but, like, if I've been on flyers, like, yeah, but, like, um, so, yeah. Okay. What? <laughs> but I can be a homebody, like, you know, but, no, but lately I haven't been out, okay. so. <laughs> what's, what's lately? Yeah. Okay, um, like, w does traveling count? Do you pop if out I've when been, you're traveling? I like, mean. if I had to go travel and, like, my, like, I'm with my friends and, like, they want to go to the club, like, does that count? I feel like, like there's a little bit of confusion between it. It's like, you I go mean, out a lot, you go out a lot. Okay, well, recently, probably about like a couple months ago. So, yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> hey, he's straight forward. <clears throat> My dude's straight right, forward, go man. go ahead and pop one of these ladies. He about to pop her. You know, we should have just stayed down there. He should <laughs> pop that, dog. Okay. She she's outside with it, baby. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Two oh, outside. Oh my gosh. Two outside, man. It was only because like you kinda not that you didn't know like how long ago or like it was just a little bit of confusion for me trying mm -hmm. to figure out when's the last time you've been out or whatever. You just okay. got two months ago. I mean maybe I'm, yeah. trying to turn over a new leaf. I respect it, but it's like it was just a little bit confusing. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Why'd you have your balloon forward. unpopped for him? Um, he's attractive. Um I didn't really see anything negative, so yeah. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> but, that, but that brown okay, one is sour, bro. Two ladies remaining. Uh, remaining, not remaining. Ladies, any questions you guys want to ask him? Okay. She said yes right away. I would like to ask you the same question. When was your last relationship and why did it end? So my last relationship was like two years ago. Um, it ended because we just, you know, weren't growing together and we had a mutual agreement. It's like, you know, we're just not going to waste any time. So. Okay. Like that. I think. Oh, you already said how long ago was he said? Yeah, two years ago. Okay, got mm -hmm. it. <laughs> Any questions? Um, yeah. So, uh, what, how soon are you looking to, like, get married, build a family, stability, or, like, a stable relationship? Probably, like, in the next, like, year and a half, two years. And so, you, like, if somebody okay. comes along that actually meets, like, I wouldn't say, like, my criteria, but, like, my standards or whatever, yeah, it'll work. Okay. That's it. Any other questions? You guys good? Oh, you do? Okay. <laughs> Are you comfortable with silence, or do you feel like you always have to fill the space with conversation? Uh, it depends. Like, we vibe out. If I know your tendencies or something, and you don't want to talk in the morning, or you need your coffee or something like that, I'm not going to press you. Okay. I like that answer. <laughs> All right. Time to pop. Wow. Okay. Why do we end up popping hers? Um, physically, physically. I just feel like I'm probably more attracted to her. That's it. See? Him, so. Hey, we got to get this guy a clap, him. man. Come on, baby. Keeping it honest, keeping it real. This is, hey. <clears throat> Listen, that's it, man. Just keep it real. He's keeping it simple and real, not the fluff stuff. He's staying away from that. Keeping it real. I like it. Let's get it. He liked the other one. She's more attractive. This one is not. Bow. Mm -hmm. I love the drip, you know. 
<laughs> and why did you have your balloon on pop for he's him? handsome and i also like the fact that he said he needs his mother approval with his woman so i appreciate it okay. Cool. okay let me bring you on up here come on up come on up all right y'all any final questions between either one of you you can go first you can go first oh, shit. you right. don't have to have one if you don't have one don't force it yeah, yeah i'm probably not gonna force it but if you got something for me yeah, I'm not gonna force either. Oh, all right. Ooh. <laughs> That's another yeah, like. Okay, so it's a yes for you for him. Yes. And is it a yes for you for her? Yeah. We got a match. Oh shoot. <laughs> I'll take this mic. And you guys can go on up. Let's give it up for them. <laughs> yeah, what you call it? That girl is sad. Look at her. She she hurt, man. She mad. <laughs> okay, ladies, let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? My name is Drew. I'm a system engineer and I'm 27. Okay, Drew, yeah. I didn't even have to ask you anything. You yeah. came out ready. Yeah, ready to go. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, so I do a couple of different things for fun. So right now I'm currently training my dog for agility courses and things like that. Um, so I'm trying to get more into that as well as like I also do a little bit of fitness stuff on the side, like motivational fitness and things like that. Okay. So just trying to expand my repertoire and be like well balanced. Okay. Yeah. And now what are some things? Hey, yo, the twin, <clears throat> they should just get her up out of here, man. I'm tired of her popping first. She could pop second, third, but she's been the first one on every guy, man. Let her fly. Let her fly. I promise. Get her out of here. She don't like nobody. What she want? Oh, she want girls. And a woman. Um, definitely someone who's more on the humble side, has a good good feet on good head on their shoulders, is able to kind of like tell me and communicate things effectively, mm -hmm. and also just be someone who's willing to listen, right? Okay. Um, I think for me, when I look for someone who's listening and capable of listening them back, we kind of make it work because I'm kind of a listener, so. Got it. Yeah. Okay. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Um, deal breakers, I would definitely have to say anybody who isn't capable of being humble. Mm -hmm. um, like there's situations and times where you might be like a little bit over stressed about something about you have a way to control yourself i think that's really 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 something that's really important so if you're not able to do that it's going to be kind of a kind of an issue okay yeah, all yeah. right so we did get a pop balloon over here okay it's going over there to see what's going on get on my nerves man all right if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon hi my name is jasmine i'm 24. okay and why'd you end up popping your balloon jasmine for no um, reason i feel like well you're very um handsome nah, appreciate that Thank um, you. yeah of course it's not really my my type. Bro, it's not really my type. She She get on my nerves, man. Get her up out of here. Like, why you brought the the other twin is sensible. This one is just like she don't got she what do you what do you want, man? Is there something specific that makes him not really your type? Um you know, and I wouldn't even say I have a type, it's just attraction. Okay. Yeah. So not really attractive. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, hey, man. Is she someone that you're talking about? Um, no, nah, I don't think so. Kind of the same. I'm not really feeling like a physical attraction. I, I love the outfit and everything, but just physically, I'm not really feeling like an attraction. I think, you know, for the most part, you go, you see someone physically, you want to make sure you can kind of mm -hmm. vibe with them a little bit first. So, okay. yeah. Cool. But you, I love the outfit, though. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah. Right. I guess you can't be mad about it. We do still have the man. rest of the balloons left unpopped. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and have you ask these ladies a question just to help you narrow it down, see who's more of your vibe. Okay. Um, so in a relationship when you're with somebody, there's always traits that come out naturally when you're with someone for a period of time. What would you say is your like most toxic trait, you would think, that something that you'd be like, oh, this is going to shot someone away? And what would you say is your best quality, like your best trait? All right. Yeah. Let's start over here with your name and age, and what is your toxic trait and your best trait? Aliyah, and I'm 25. I would say my toxic trait would be I would shut down. I need time to process the situation before I can actually talk to you, but a lot of people like to talk in that moment to resolve the issue, so I would say that was my toxic, toxic trait. And then for my most, what was the question? Was uh, the, your best trait. My best trait, um, my optimism. I'm very optimistic. I just love thinking about the future and what can possibly happen. Okay, okay. Your name and age and the answer to his question. I'm Asia, I'm 25, and I would say my best trait that comes out, I think I'm like really helpful if I notice something like that you might need help in or like you forgot to do something, I'll always like try to help out any way I can. And then toxic trait, I would say I'll just like ghost people. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Questions on that? Um, when you mean uh, ghost, like, uh, 
do you just kind of vanish and then have a reason why you vanish? Do you come back and at least give a reason or you just Yeah, I'll drop give a it? reason. I'll give a reason. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I try uh, not to do that okay. anymore, but it tends to happen. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um No, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Appreciate that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. no problem. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she know he coming <laughs> to pop her. What is your best treat and toxic treat? With TD Complete Checking, Gina's ready to live her best life. My name is Princess. I'm 23. Um, I would say my best trait is that I'm very understanding. I'm very patient, sometimes more patient than I need to be. Um, I would say my toxic trait would be I'm an overthinker, um, so I keep a lot of thoughts to myself and ponder on it before, you know, I start to come to a conclusion. But I'm not, like, the type where it's like I'm going to accuse you or something. I just overthink a lot of different things so that's that's what I okay well, i'm a listener so you can you know <laughs> just tell me whatever i'll say i'll be a therapist for sure <laughs> okay yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank, you. thank you we'll be back for you let's go over here your name and age and i'm taylor i'm 22 <clears throat> hold on I, now real quick i think the one in the brown that popped her balloon i think she popped because she don't want to be rejected again because she hurt man i'm just i'm just saying what i think it is i think she's very hurt for especially the last like like she didn't have to do that to the last guy but she did do it she did not have to do that i don't know why but i think she's hurt or, or she just think he's gonna reject her so she just popped it that's what i'm thinking could be wrong and my toxic trait would be um probably my attitude but i've been working on it um yeah and then what was the other one uh, your best trait my best trait um i'm motivational like i will push you to do things um i'll be on top of you so i mean and then if you need anything too like i'm always a good listener so okay yeah okay appreciate that <laughs> um i kind of want to go back on that uh you mentioned like you said like attitude that was like your yeah um can you kind of explain like what do you mean by like attitude like say for example i didn't fill up your car with gas or something like that i forgot or something oh, like that like, like yeah, can you kind of like how would I react to the situation? Yeah, like how would you react? Yeah, say like say like I did something in the past and then like that was the final thing and like now you're like I've had it like. Oh yeah, I'm gonna tell you everything. But, okay. Um, would you let it build up? Would you communicate um, that? No, I, I communicate it okay. for sure. But if like you, you're just doing the same thing over and over again, then yeah, I don't know how to explain it, but. It's <laughs> <Sorry>. okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, that's actually a good answer though. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank <sure>. you. Yeah. <laughs> Your name and age, and what is your best trait and toxic trait? <laughs> I'm Paris. I'm 28. Uh, my best trait is that I'm, like, down to earth, everything. Um, I don't have a toxic trait. I have growth traits. And so my growth trait is basically, shoot, sometimes I like shut down. I have my moments. I'm not a person that have mood swings. It's just that I'm, like, a person that you have to be able to understand because I have a pattern. But they're not bad patterns. They're like good patterns. When you know, you know. A pattern? So, yeah. Okay. What is pattern? Okay. Yo, I yeah, think um, I think she just don't know certain words, bro. I'm not trying to be, you know, slick. But pattern and pattern. Let me even look that up to make sure I'm I'm not tripping. Okay. Just like I thought, pattern and pattern are definitely not the same thing. And pattern is not a word. So it's patterns. And then she said, I'm the mystic or whatever she said. That's probably not even a word. I, I didn't find it. I, I searched it. I didn't find it. But if you did, drop it in the comments. I'm good. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Yeah. All right. We did get a pop over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Alex. I'm 25. Um, I just don't see myself being like your woman. I see myself like being your friend. Like we can hang out. Yeah. You're you're attractive. Nothing Appreciate wrong with that. You. Thank you. I just don't see myself being with you. Okay. That's all. Okay. Is it something he said or is it? Oh, his pants are kind of tight, but he's not ugly or anything. Fit, I just, so, you know, I just I feel like I we can be so. like we can be <laughs> friends and go like to the bar and drink. Okay. okay. That's about it. Yeah, okay. Not right. serious. <laughs> right. And uh, she's someone that's your type? Um, No, I think kind of like on the friend basis, like you were saying, I would definitely 
see us like kind of vibing as friends kind of thing. Um, you really direct with your approach of kind of why you pop your balloon and things like that. So I really appreciate that. And that's kind of like what I like to have in my friend group anyway. Someone who's more direct kind of, you know, be able to communicate effectively. So yeah, uh, not really my type per se preference wise, but definitely a friend for sure. Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, so I am going to have you pop. Hmm, how many balloons should we do? Let's do two balloons. Okay. Oh. I know. Right. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and hand you a pick. There you go. All and right. go ahead and pop those two balloons, and then I'll follow you and ask you why you ended up popping after you pop those two. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> pop. Get it out of there. Pop. Okay. Let's start with the first one you popped. Yeah. So why did we end up popping her balloon? Um... Honestly, the responses you gave were really nice and everything. I think it was just a fit. Um, I wasn't really feeling the fit kind of thing. Um, you seem very, very humble, which is top notch. Like, I love that. Um, but I think it was just like the fit. So, yeah. But you're really, you, you, you're well spoken. So, you know. <laughs> no, yeah. she not, dog. Patterns. So balloon unpopped for him. Mm, I kind of see it like you cool, you know. Could be like a cute little partnership or whatever type thing i mean okay. hey <laughs> it ain't nothing too bad to say about you for real but yeah okay. you know thank you and i don't know what she said um i think the thing that you mentioned and i know you said you're kind of working on it was kind of like the attitude control kind of thing mm -hmm. i think for me i've had relationships in the past where that has been something they said they're working on and it ended up being like a, a big big problem so i think my fear of kind of diving into that again I'm not saying that it's always bad. Sometimes it's good because sometimes you need that counterbalance. Um, I think that's what kind of deterred me away. Other than that, um, love the outfit. Like you're well spoken as well. Thank um, you. But yeah, that's that's the primary thing. Yeah. Okay. Right. <laughs> and so, why did you have your balloon unpopped for him? Um, I love dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, that girl in the red. I'm telling you, she got she she got the she got the yappers. Remember how the guy said he liked yappers? She's a yapper, but in a bad way. She will, um, attitude galore. And so you said you were doing your training with dogs, right? Yeah, I'm training my dog. dog right now, yeah. Um, yep. So, yeah, and I go to the gym. I go to the gym like four or five times a week. So, and I don't know, you seem like you know what you want. So I kind of like that. Yeah, so, yeah. appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. All right. And we did get a pop balloon back here. Okay, why did we end up popping? I didn't want to pop, but the more I was like looking at you, you really kind of like resemble my uncle. Ooh. Yeah, that's not yeah, a bad yeah, thing. My yeah. uncle's, uncle's really handsome. Yeah. You're a handsome Thank man, you. but I just, yeah. Couldn't too, look too much. Yes. Mm, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. And, uh, is she someone that's your type? Uh, yeah, I, I, would, I would say so for sure. Well put together. Thank you. Um, yeah, I would definitely, yeah, for sure. I would definitely approach her if I saw her out 100%. Yeah. yeah. Just had to be the uncle, it's huh? The uncle. <laughs> 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 All right. Um, any questions, ladies, for our guy? Okay, let's start down here. Um, how do you feel about somebody with kids? Um, yeah, great question. Um, so with kids, I like, I would rather prefer like to grow with somebody and kind of start a family on my own. But um, I've kind of been able to kind of evolve from that a little bit. So the person has kids, as long as it's not like a bunch of kids with different like baby daddies, that kind of thing then I'm, I'll be able to kind of grow and, and, and kind of change and adapt. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I have one child. Okay. Okay. That's all. How old is the child? She's five. Five? Yes. Okay. 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 <laughs> I think we had a question over here. Yes. Um, where are you from? I'm from New York City originally. Okay. Yeah. And where do you reside now? I reside actually here in Scottsdale, Arizona. Yeah. So is distance, will distance be a problem for you? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And where do you reside? Oh, Georgia. Georgia. Savannah. Okay. 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 Oh man. All right. So you did have your balloon and pop for him for quite some time. What you know was intriguing you? He's attractive, very well spoken, good head on his shoulders. Thank you. I like just the overall aesthetic. Appreciate yeah. that. Thank you. Yeah. And now she's someone that's your type. Would you approach her if you saw her out? Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, differently, like uh qualities kind of like my mom not in a weird way like motherly qualities that i said that before you know, i came to you. <laughs> just like you know just like you know i mean obviously i feel like every guy like if they have a good relationship with their family their mom is kind of their first 
girlfriend, so to speak, you know. So um, I like to look for, like, attitude and charisma like that. Mm -hmm. And she definitely uh, exemplifies that. So, yeah, for sure. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. All right, we did get a pop down here. Why did we end up popping? The, the kid thing. I think um, I would prefer someone who's just already like, oh, yeah, I don't, you know, I don't have no problem with that. Um, there's a lot that comes with having a child, so I wouldn't want it to be a burden on you type deal. So. Okay, I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Right. Now okay. she's someone that's your type? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, like the, the response you just said, even though like a balloon got popped, but like <laughs> the response you said, though, was very like, very like well put together, well like articulated and things like that. Yeah. And that's definitely like shows that you're mature enough to understand like, okay, what would this person be experiencing if I brought exactly. their, you know, my life into theirs kind of thing and incorporated both. So yeah, definitely. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Thank you. Yep. Oh man, we were so close. Uh, yeah. <laughs> close <laughs> well, but no cigar, right? right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is yeah. all the balloons popped, unfortunately. But thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for him, ladies. Thank I'll you. Thank you. Mic. Thank you. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Jesse. Jesse, how old are you? I am 26. And what do you do? I'm a substation operator for electrical utility. Okay. <laughs> what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I like to work out, read, I like doing outdoor activities like hiking, swimming, scuba diving. Um, yeah, I like to cook too. I went to culinary school. Oh, okay. We got a chef. We got a chef. <laughs> and uh, what are some things you're looking for in a woman? Uh, someone who can communicate oh, wow. effectively. Someone who's honest and loyal. What are you looking for? Like a friendship? Oh my as gosh, well she popped yeah. hers. Okay, all right. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Or like a friend. Uh, someone who can communicate effectively. Someone who's honest and loyal. What are you looking for? Like a friendship hmm. as well as a relationship, you know? Okay, all right. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, bad hygiene. Mm. Yeah, someone who's close minded as well. Okay. Yeah. All right. So we did get a few pop balloons. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. Okay. <laughs> All right. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Jasmine. I'm 24. And um, maybe it's the outfit. I'm sorry. That's, that's fair. You're really handsome, though. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. What are you not feeling about his outfit? Well, um,. It's not my style. Okay. Yeah. And I do have like a preference, you know, like a type. Because, mm. Oh okay. my well, not, gosh. Okay. So that, let me clarify. I wouldn't say that I have a type, but attraction, you know? Mm. Yeah. Okay. She's someone that's your type? Uh. What the heck is. I'm just. Hey. Somebody help me in the comments with that. I would approach her. Okay. All right. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. A lion. I'm 25. It's just the overall attraction. I feel like you know, you know when you know, like that's it. Overall, you're okay. nice and new. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, she's someone you'd approach. Is she your type? Yeah, she's pretty. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he is a. Sh <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Name and age, and why you ended up popping your balloon? I'm Asia. I'm 25, and um, I ended up popping my balloon just because I wasn't attracted. Like the initial attraction wasn't there for me. Yeah. Okay. What about for yourself? Um, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I probably wouldn't approach, but oh. if you approach, I'll have a conversation with you. Okay. Why wouldn't you approach? Why wouldn't I approach? Mm -hmm. It's not necessarily my type. Okay. That's fair. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is there something specific that makes her not your type? Um, it would probably have to be like, be like resting face. Oh, it's mean? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Yeah. But for me, I just want know. someone more pleasant looking. Yeah, someone I looks like you. inviting, you know. Okay. That's fair. Okay. All right, let's go over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Princess. I'm 23. Um, initially, I was going to wait. It was something that was throwing me off at first. I couldn't put my finger on it. But I think it's the beard, like the long. Oh. I don't really go for that. I love the dimples, though. That's my weakness. I, I'm, I'm going <laughs> to tell you. But yeah, the beard just, I don't know. It just threw me off. Oh, okay. So you like it more like shorter? Or? Yeah, like, yeah, it's just like too long. <laughs> 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 All right. And now uh, she's someone that's your type? Um. Yeah, she's attractive. I like the freckles. Oh, I appreciate That's it. That's nice. <laughs> okay. You say you like All the right, freckles. And we do have one more pop down here. Okay, your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Paris. I'm 28. So, I basically did the work for you. Um, you deserve a woman. That's 100% submissive. I'm not. I'm a switch, but I have a lot of dominating energy. I'm going to be real with you. 
So that's really it. You're handsome. You really are. Thank you. But yeah, just even ground. Just that's, <laughs> that's it. Okay. Now is she someone you'd approach to your type? Yeah, she's she's okay. Okay. <laughs> you said she's okay. So would you approach her? Um. <laughs> Probably she has not. a nice smile. Thank Probably. You. Yes. If I didn't see her smile, maybe. Okay. Maybe not. But. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> So we do have two balloons left unpopped right on over here. Any questions you want to ask these ladies? Now, first of all, hold on. First of all, the brown one. She sold the other guy who was a bit taller than him, I, I think. And I think a little bit bigger than him that he was skinny. So she is, she's, y'all y'all just know she lying. That, that was, she was just hurt because the guy told her that he wasn't, you know, she, she was not attractive to him. So let's see what she say. Let's see. I'm, I'm expecting something, some, some, I don't know. Let's see. Um, what are your red flags? Mm, okay, let's start with your, as, oh, hold on. Uh, let's start with your name and age, and then what are your red flags, or if you want to ask them to clarify. So far as red flags, I don't like a man who don't know how to communicate. I hate a man who can go all day without talking to me. That makes me want to block you, because I need to know what's going on. You know, um, I hate a liar. I hate um, if you have kids. It's a red flag to me. Um, I don't like short men. Um, I mean, your beard is okay. I don't know. Like, how do you? No, I don't. No. Okay. But gender popping. His beard. But how do you? Never mind. But um, look at yeah, her. That's it. Okay. <laughs> he's he's not ugly or anything. I just I can be like a long distance friend. Mm. That's not it. Okay. Not wrong with him. Okay. You know. Is she someone well, that's your type or did you want to ask was, me questions? What are your red flags? Not red flags. Yeah, I know I was just more I was looking at you more I'm just like thinking things. So I was like so going ahead. Ask, how do I take care of it? No, it's gonna be something else, but I, it's not appropriate. So I just said she talking about how she go. I I knew it, bro. I I knew she was talking about how did he go downstairs? How is the downstairs action happening? And how do you get the? She nasty, man. Yo, get her out of here, bro. Just you know, don't right. it, it's you know it no big deal, but I got gotcha. you. Somebody will handle it, but okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> so is she someone you approach if you saw her out? Uh, she your type? Yeah, she has a nice body. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so let's go ahead and answer his question. Okay. <laughs> we'll start off with your name and age and what are your red flags? Yes. Okay. Um, I'm Taylor, I'm 22, and my red flags in a relationship, um, I don't really know. I don't really, I can't think of a red flag for me. I don't know. Um, well, something that like, a guy has kind of like said told me before yeah probably mood swings mm -hmm. and the attitude so. oh you're saying these are red flags someone told you but i think you want to know what are red flags that she sees in no that a guy? she has oh that she has like, oh, okay okay she said she couldn't think of any so that's why i said like what yeah I said i've had because. people tell me about my attitude <laughs> yeah. and mood swings um that's really it. That's what I can think of. But any questions for him? Um, do you uh, live out here? No. Sorry, <laughs> I just can't. I did it before. I can't do it. You did long distance yeah. for us now. Okay. Yeah. And where are you coming from? Detroit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. I mean, there is nothing but a flight, but it's just right. I can't. Yeah. Mm -mm. Yeah, okay, sorry. <laughs> so you did have your balloon on pop for him for quite some time. Why so? Um, you like going to the gym. I do. Um, you seem well spoken. You like to cook. I like to cook. Um, yeah, just some similarities I like. So yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Now she's someone that's your type. Yeah, she has a pretty small. Thank you. I like short girls. So. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> like if you're like California or like yeah. Okay. Detroit's too far. Sorry. <gasps> All right, let's head on back. <laughs> okay, so that's all the balloons popped, unfortunately, but thank you so much for coming on. Let's give it up for him, ladies. I'll take this mic. Thank you. Thank you.
All right, guys, this, this, this was a long one. Pause. Hey, yo. Uh, we're going to stop the video right there. Uh, drop your thoughts in the comments. Which lady was the most confusing to you? I need y'all to drop that in the comments. Definitely smash the like button. That's all I got for you guys. Steady at TV. Catch you guys on the next video.